All right, another resource that I have as we're continuing this uh, <coughs> series on resources, suggested resources, um, has been around for quite a while. Um, most of you probably own it or have seen it or have a different variation of it, but it is the uh, Peterson's Field Guide, and this one is on Field Guide to Medicinal Plants and Herbs. <coughs> so this one just focused um, on uh, medicinal value. Um, with that being said, almost all of them in here are also edible. They just have a medicinal value as well. And so they talk about different historical uses from Native Americans and early pioneers uh, for medicine of different plants. Um, this is the third edition revised. Um, I got uh, this on uh, Amazon, I think it was maybe like 10 bucks, something like that. And uh, retail on it's like 21. So I, I got it off Amazon, it was much cheaper. I just know that much. Again, this is a field guide and uh, in that it is uh, easy to pack. Uh, the size of it is probably eight by six if I had to guess. And um, the pages do have the plastic coating on them so that if you get the wet, uh, water is not gonna be an issue and ruin the page. Um, again, I'm not, not harping on that for any purpose uh, specifically, but I think that should be standard on a field guide because a field guide means you're going to take it into the field to guide you on this topic. If you take a book that does not have these coatings into the field and it rains or gets wet or you drop it, uh, regular paper can get ruined easily. These uh, pages are much more durable, a little tougher when it comes to tearing, and uh, are not going to get ruined by the water. So just throwing that out there for inspiring authors. Um, also the pictures in here are good, they give uh, variations of the pictures in um, a young shoot and mature. Um, it talks about, uh, uh, um, let's see, let me just pick one out here. Uh, <coughs> there's one I did, a, uh, uh, a video on. Okay. So we got like uh, here, for example, we got like shepherd's purse and uh, uh, Let's see, that's a tooth wart, poor man's pepper, and winter crest, and then has information about them on there. So it at least gives one good picture of each plant. On some of them, it gives multiples. Um, also, if you can take a look here at the bottom, it has a colored guide. Uh, that guide is for an actual reference. It talks about different types of trees, different types of shrubs, different types of flowers, and, uh, and something along those lines. So that, that color code um, is intentional and it lines up with the uh, table of contents in the beginning of the book. So it helps guide you through this book. Um, if you're looking for something a little on the, uh, the quick side, <coughs> you have that, that reference there um, uh, as well. So it's kind of like a color coded deal. Um, Peterson's Field Guide, been around for a long time, bestseller, best-selling guides of all time. Um, like I said, this is third edition, uh, Steve Foster and Dr. James Duke are the authors, and this is just a great resource. Um, it's a, kind of standard for woodsmen who are looking for educating themselves on uh, plants. So, spent many hours reading this one, and most all the books that I have, I've read all of. So. Um, just another resource there, Peterson's Field Guide to uh, Medicinal Plants. Alright guys, hope this was helping you. Thanks for watching. God bless.